Hello everyone, welcome, welcome. My name's Charlie and today I'm gonna to be hopping back into some more Stardew Expanded. And as always, I'm super excited. Now, last time around, we did a huge monster crop quest for Lance and we ended up getting this like diamond wand sword staff thing. But now I'm like, what's my purpose in life? We could say hello to apples. Apples is always an option. And oh yeah, I think I should get a divorce. I've been thinking about it for a while. It's just, it breaks my heart heart, but I do think that it's the right thing to do. So maybe we'll do that today. I don't know. Oh, another thing is that last time I found the little maple bear store, but everybody was saying that wasn't what I was supposed to find. That if I like literally walked in the other direction, I would have gone to a new area. So I'm going to try and find that right now. Oh my gosh, is this it? I think I may have found it. Yes, this was it. Everybody said I was supposed to go right. <gasps> oh my gosh, what is this? A human? There's a human here. Wait, a new person? <gasps> or a new Junimo? Wait, the human understands us? Yeah, I'm, I'm listening to every word you're saying. I'm Klaus. Interesting. I want to see them. And I'm Angelica. This place is called Sprite Spring. The water here has special fortifying properties. If you swim across, there are flowers you can take home with you. Visit us again and you might find some rare forage. Okay. Take this. It should do the trick for your spell. Oh, so I'm gonna add this to my nexus? No way. What are you waiting for? Swim across the spring and summon your warp. They're like, come on, just swim right across. Just go to the other side. I promise you'll, you'll, you won't die. Oh, no, it actually appears to be safe here. Okay, so here is the spring. Are, so are these like just disembodied voices or are they Junimo or, oh my God, I'm naked. It's freezing probably. Get, get in the water, you. Whoa, whoa, there's a secret thing up there. I see it. I have good vision. What is this? Show me. Holy shiitakes. What? This is, this cannot be real. What is happening right now? Why are there so many forgeables? So there's a little secret mushroom thing here. Oh my holy croci, what? This is absurd. Eight holly, 20 croci, and two crystal fruit. That is actually crazy. I, there's probably better stuff in like the summer and seasons when there's more forage and everything. So I'll definitely have to come back and check it out. Oh, <gasps> that is so beautiful. The little tulips. I love that. So I think we have room for two more warp things. Probably one will go here. And I don't know where the other one will go, but wow. We have made some big progress. I have four ancient fruit right now that are all iridium and I need five gold star for the missing bundle. I think it actually does count. So we literally just need one more ancient fruit. We have the mayonnaise and then we need wine. This is going so well. I don't see like any other humans anywhere. So I'm gonna go visit apples. Hello, oh, so cute. Hello apples, what the, um, question. There's like star fruit in here now. These weren't here before. I am almost certain of that. Did I miss something? I, I, maybe it's like getting more overgrown over time. It's like part of the mystery. Oh my God, no way. Terever is actually sleeping in his bed? What is this? I have never seen a child sleep in the bed. He's finally like normal. This is great news. I picked up more baby food at Pierre's the other day. <gasps> oh my God, I totally forgot I'm pregnant. Oh, that's why there's two pet. Oh, no, 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 no. I need to divorce this. Oh, hello. Hey there. I wanted to drop by and tell you I just started working as a farmhand for some local farmers in the valley. Oh, this is Sophia's best friend. Also, you should totally visit me in Grampleton. There's a kiosk at the railroad station. My address is 106 Pondwood Road. Swing by sometime. That's so cool that Scarlet's moving here. I wonder if that means that she's like a giftable NPC now. <gasps> she is! No way, that's so sick. Wait, that might mean that we actually can go to Grampleton. Hello? <gasps> Hello? <gasps> oh my God, we are in a new area. We are in new territory. What is this? It's the Pondwood Bulletin Board. There's a bunch of activities and advertisements listed. Oh, this is Scarlet's house. Oh, there's new people here. What? But Scarlet's house is not the only thing here. There's like other stuff. There's a whole bridge. What the? There's another area? 
I shouldn't wander too far into the suburb. Okay, so I can't go that way. I can only go to Scarlet's house, but this is still a really cool little area. I was not expecting to find a new place today. That's so cool. Someone's at the front door? Oh, hello dear, hello Camilla. Wait, where are we going? Wait, this is my Nexus, okay. Your Nexus is beautiful, almost as good as mine. I hope you don't mind me borrowing you. There's important business we have to attend to. Hold my hand, okay? Where are we going? What is going on? She just stole me away in the middle of the night from my own house. <laughs> what is this? What? Welcome to the continent of Galdera, a place beset by both miracles and curses. Whoa. This outpost borders the Crimson Badlands, a magical wasteland formed by the aftermath of ancient dark magic. Scorching heat by day, nights cold as ice, quicksand dunes, lightning sandstorms, hordes of monsters, void zones. That sounds really bad. You enjoy swinging your sword so much, why not swing it for me? It'll be the ultimate test of your prowess as an adventurer. Let's get to the fun part. Summon your warp runes. Oh my god. Here. This is called a swirl stone. May it allow you to complete your spell. This is so cool. Show me what Razzie taught you. I'll just watch. Oh, a little test? Oh my gosh. This is really scary. Let's not mess it up, please. Well, I suppose I'll return you to that adorable farm of yours. Next time you feel the urge to adventure, consider lending Castle Village your aid. Um... What? Oh my gosh. I... am going there. Immediately. Like, right tomorrow. Now. I am so excited, actually. I was in the middle of gathering, like, loved gifts to people to try and up all the friendship points I have, but... but... come on! I'm gonna do that instead. Okay, so I think we should have a new point in our nexus. Oh, <gasps> it looks so freaking cool. You've gotta be kidding me. There's bones and everything. Is that a lava katana? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna pee myself. Okay, let's go. Let's explore this area for the first time. Everything changes too. My cursor's like red. Everything has stone all over it. The whole, like, this is so cool. What? What did I just do? <gasps> it's- it's a, a, Alexia! Alessia! Charlie? Dot dot dot. Hello, Isaac. Oh, you haven't made each other's acquaintance. Isaac, Charlie hails from the Adventurer's Guild in Stardew Valley under Marlin's banner. That sounds really dope. That is what I do. Humph. <laughs> okay. Isaac, give Charlie your regional map and meet me at the guild hall. May Yoba guide you, adventurer. Um, thank you. <laughs> I am definitely not prepared, but let's freaking go. I hope you have a good memory. I'm only showing you this once. Jeez, I'm Isaac. I don't know what I did to get on your bad side. Okay, there's stuff over here. There's stuff over here. And then there's a big stuff over here. You'll enter the Badlands through that Eastern cave. Keep moving and don't get cornered. So go, <laughs> okay, okay, I got it. I, I memorized that, I have a good memory. Oh, and keep an eye out for corrupted serpents. Be ready to swallow your pride and run. Okay. Thanks, Isaac. Good to meet you. Thank you so much. I'm really afraid. I don't know. I'm definitely not ready for this, but I'm gonna do it anyway, you know? All right, let's just go in. Let's just freaking do it. What the... What the heck? The sand is so cool. What is the... Oh, oh, oh. I, I am gonna die already. I haven't even taken like two steps. I have no food. I have no food. I have nothing. I entered through the eastern cave, which means that over to the left, there's stuff. What's this? Void soul. I will be taking all of these. Thank you very much. Oh my gosh, there's definitely a new fish in here. If only I could breathe for a moment to cast my line. Okay, I think right here I might be safe for a bit. What the undead fish? What the freaking what? What what? Oh my gosh. A bone fish? Oh my there's so many new things in this pond. Hello? I'm gonna keep moving because I could literally sit here and fish all day and I shouldn't. Oh, fudge, 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 fudge. I can't dodge them. I need a sword so I can dodge them. Maybe I can use the diamond wand. Oh, 
Freaking see you never. Oh my gosh, this thing's actually kind of crazy. That solved all my problems. Goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Get yoat. Oh, that one doesn't get yeeted. Oh, 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 no. I've entered a very bad place, a very bad place, and I hate it here. Oh my god, this might be the end for me. This may be the end for little Charlie. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I gotta eat. Oh my god. Oh no, this is a dead end. This is a dead end. This is a dead end. No way, no way, no way, no way, no way, no way. My ear's itchy. My ear's itchy. Oh, there's a little passage. Okay, my ear is handled. What is over here? This is so cool. Oh no. Oh, I need a pickaxe now? There's so much like iridium stuff. I- this is such a bad idea. I don't know where I'm going. It's getting dark. It's getting late. Okay. Okay. Uh-oh. Oh my god, I'm about to die. No way did that just happen. Get out- get out of here. These guys cannot touch me or they will mess me up. That is- that is certified. I was at full health. That thing touched me and suddenly I was- I was a whisper from death. I love how Lance was like, don't go out there, there's a big monster at, at the top of the highlands, so you don't want to go out there because you want to stay safe. And I was like, I'm gonna go battle it. And then Camilla was literally like, yeah, it's li like, go fight for me. You could die. These are all, this is a list of all 20 million things that can kill you, but like, you should still do it anyway and prove that you're not a baby. I do not think that there's anything positive to come out of that little maze. I didn't see any other passage, uh-oh. I- <laughs> What are those swords doing here? Oh, there's just swords laying on the ground. Don't mind if I freaking do. I like forgot mine. This is fantastic. I'm gonna use the lava katana, I think. Oh, this is, this is great news. This is really great news. Oh my gosh, there's so many swords on the ground. I could sell all these for a, a pretty penny. Goodness, it's really just take your pick. There's so many, who are you? Can I talk to you? No, I think you're a bad. I think you're a bad person. I'm running. I'm running. <gasps> That's the thing he said. Just like run for your life and die. Okay. We need to go home soon. We need to go home soon. Yoba, please guide me. <gasps> Yoba heard me. Get. Oh, I can't go through? The magical barrier prevents you from entering Castle Village. Guys, come on. You gotta let me in. Do you, you know what's out here? Please let me in. Okay, I need to use my totem. Oh, I was so close to immediate death right there. What was that? We got so many like swords and void pebbles and void souls. The corrupted life essence of what once was. It's a key ingredient in potion brewing. That was so cool. I can't just like go to the Feast of the Winter Star and pretend that I didn't go to like the scariest, coolest place on earth. Like now do you see why I need to be with Lance? There's so much lore there. Like there is so much. It just makes me think I'm so, not like above all the other villagers, but like there are so many layers that I'm going deep into with like magic and teleporting and different monsters and places and stuff. It's like, I don't wanna just be in Pelican Town. I don't want to just like be a married and a mom and like live a normal farming life. The point of this is go do the Stardew Expanded stuff and I want to know everything there is to know. And you know what? I just gassed myself up. I'm getting a divorce. Tomorrow. I forgot that today was a holiday. I, you know, the next non-business day. That's when. Merry Feast of the Winter Star, Trevor. I have a gift for you at home I'll show you tonight. Doubtful. Okay, I'm gonna give you a grape, Vincent. A grape, thanks. You're welcome. You enjoyed that grape, <laughs> that one single grape. Oh, and Caroline is my secret Santa. Let's see what I got. An emerald, wow. All right, good, good. That was a great year, everybody. That was a great winter star. I'll see you guys next time. This is my last night sleeping with Victor. I may cry. Thank you for all the memories. I really do love you, but I think it has to be done for the lore. And you know, I do want to mention that I genuinely love Victor as a character, and most of the reason I'm divorcing him is because I've already finished his hard events, and from what I hear, Lance's hard events actually open up the world so much more and go deeper into the lore of the game. This is a Stardew Expanded playthrough after all, and I really want to get the most out of it, and I feel like it makes the most sense to see some of the other characters' hard events just to keep things fun. I hope that's understandable. I think spouses get pretty static once you've completed their hard events, even in the regular game, so I'm really, really excited to see see what happens in the future. <sighs>
It is- this is- I can't. I'm- it hurts. It really does hurt. Oh, Lewis, give me strength, please. And is- is Victor gonna hate me? Because I don't want him to hate me. I'm getting, like, emotional thinking of all the stuff we've done. Like, he got his bridge building job, and we found Dewey, and we had a kid, and like... Oh, man. But it needs to be done. <sighs> your divorce papers have been filed, but your spouse won't know until tomorrow morning. I feel horrible. Ugh. Something j it just feels wrong. Because I love Victor so much. Even still, and I'm just like... Ugh. I think it'll be worth it in the end. When we get into new areas and new stuff, I'll feel like I made the right call. For right now though, it really is like breaking my heart. Okay, I need to move on. I think for now, the thing that makes the most sense to do would be to talk to probably Rasmodius and Lance because they are kind of connected to Castle Village and Camilla and all that stuff. And I'm curious to see if they have any dialogue changes or if it'll open up any other doors. Hi, Rasmodius. Klaus and Angelica told me you found the Sprite Spring. On clear nights, Angelica flies over the valley among the stars, showering farms below with magic, encouraging crops to grow. <gasps> Angelica is the, the is the crop fairy? That is so cool. Now we know that the crop fairy's name is Angelica. Okay, so Razzie did not have anything to say about Castle Village or the whole Crimson Badlands type of stuff. I'm wondering if maybe Lance will though. And it is a Friday, pretty sure he's on Ginger Island. Hate that I know that, but I'm gonna go ahead there right now. Lance, are you here? And oh, hello. There's many adventurers who hail from the first slash, including me. I'll take you with me there someday. Oh my gosh, that would be so freaking cool. Also, here is a mushroom. Okay, so it doesn't seem like anybody has anything to say about what I've been through. I guess this is just commonplace for all other people and I'm just the only one freaking out. Good morning, Trevor! Oh my god! Victor and I are divorced now. I totally forgot. Does that mean we're not friends anymore? Like, do I go back to zero? Oh no! I'm so sad. I'm actually so sad. I'm gonna go give him a spaghetti. Is that invasive? Should I give time? I'm really scared. I've never divorced anybody in Stardew before. Oh god. Oh god. I'm that like crazy- uh. Oh. Victor is just a pixel person. Victor's not actually sad. It's just me that's sad. So I- it's okay. Hi Victor. Charlie, you broke my heart. I put my life into you and you do this to- Oh my god! You didn't do anything, there's just more lore out there that I want to know. I'm so sorry. For old times sake. Okay, fair enough. That doesn't feel good. That feels real bad. Um, why am I actually sad about this? Why am I legitimately very deeply sad? I need to like fight things in the Crimson Badlands and just take my mind off it because I'm legitimately heartbroken. This is cathartic, I will say. I'm too sad to battle. Oh, I keep missing stuff. Oh no. That's the death giver. That's the like, the one that Isaac was talking about, I think. I need to stay far away from those. Oh! Oh baby! That was my last healing thing that I have. I don't have any food. Who comes to the Badlands without food? I only have the spaghetti, the rejection spaghetti. <laughs> I hate this. No, you know what? This spaghetti symbolizes something new. I think deep down in his code, Victor knows that it wasn't personal and that it was just... It just had to be done. And why are there so many freaking enemies here? And by eating the spaghetti, I think that everything will be okay. Uh-oh. Oh, no. No, 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 no! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Victor, I love you. I'm eating the spaghetti, but I still love you. And here I will die for you, probably. I deserved that. My my, you were bested. Please don't be Camilla. Oh, this is just not what I need right now. Luckily for you, I arrived just in the nick of time. Thanks, Camilla. Okay, Marlin, I found like 20 million swords in the desert. You can have most of them, honestly. I don't really want this. I don't even know what to do with myself. I just feel lost. I'm like, why can't I just have a relaxing trip to go fishing? Okay, are we good? No, we're not good. Nothing's good. Nothing is good. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Why? 
I... I sensed you were in grave danger. Thanks so much. I'm sure I lost everything. Seven items? I lost my galaxy dagger. What is happening? My dearest granddaughter. Oh no. I just can't wait for you to tell me that I'm garbage right after my ex-husband just did. You're a better farmer than I ever was, and you've brought great honor to the family. Wait, did I do good? I can feel it now. My spirit is finally put to rest. Where is Grandpa? Isn't he usually, like, floating? Future Vote Farm is in your hands now. Farewell. I can't even see you. You're still- you're still gone to me, but it's okay. How many candles do I have, baby? Four candles! That is super awesome! Okay, now that it's spring, I'm actually super excited because I want to go back to that little, like, sprite pond area and try and see if there's any different forageables or- I just want to see what's going on there. What the heck? Oh, because it's the spring, he can sit outside. I'm crying. Yay, Apple's friend is here. Apple's work hard decorating new home. Come, come, Apple's show. Whoa. It looks the same. Starfruit growing home now. Meet Donna. Hello, Donna. This fig. Okay, hello, fig. Nice to meet you. Apple's introduced me to more of their plant friends in the cellar. They each have a name. That is so precious. I love apples to death. Oh, apples. Here's a star fruit. Donna likes you. Fig does not like you. Fig no tell apples why. Fig, do you want to freaking fight? You know what this is? It's called a pickaxe, buddy. I don't know what your deal is with me, but you need to figure yourself out. I have beef with Fig now, and I simply don't know why. Whoa, it's so pretty in the spring. Now let's see what kind of forageables we got waiting for us. Anything? Hopefully. They're all winter. Oh! <gasps> the last ancient fruit we need. We need to toss that into the, the secret bundle. All right, let's go to Ginger Island real quickly. I realize that Ginger Island is very disheveled. We need to build the resort still, and I'm kind of banking on building the resort and getting the wine for the secret bundle from there because I think that Gus sells like gold star wine or something. So I kind of want to get this built up. I need seven golden walnuts, and I, I don't know where to find them. Maybe fishing? I don't know if I've ever fished here before. Oh, a nut! Oh. Oh. Whoa. I forgot how absolutely horrifying that was. Oh, oh my god, I found it. Okay, but now the resort is done which means we can get our wine and then we can get the movie theater oh it looks so good uh it's, it's wednesday tomorrow i don't remember the schedule or like when people actually go there and when gus sells stuff hopefully it's wednesdays <laughs> what is happening hello look at the starfish it's so cute it's got a little face oh my god beautiful day isn't it yeah could you give, like, warning next time? That actually jump-scared me. Apologies for startling you. That wasn't my intention. I was actually hoping to speak with you. I've been patrolling Ginger Island for a long time, since well before you arrived. I've witnessed you communicating with birds, exchanging walnuts for many labor-intensive deeds. Thanks to you, they've repaired the bridge and even summoned a beach resort, complete with a full bar. That is why I got it, yes. I have to say, I've encountered many adventurers during my time in the guild, but none as mysterious such as yourself. <laughs> are you familiar with magic relics, Charlie? There are many ancient artifacts imbued with magic waiting to be found around the world, many of which come from Galdera, and I just so happen to have a few on me. Here, hold this. What is it? Another scepter staff. You received a blink relic? What the heck does that do? Use that to follow me up that cliff. Just focus on where you want to go and grip the relic tightly. What? That's so sick. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm on an island! You catch on to new magic quickly, I see. Ah, now this is a view. I like this spot. This is really beautiful. Have you learned about that ship yet during your time on the island? They were sailing on a cloudy night and the ship hit the reef and sank. Some of the sailors were washed away, but a few of them made it to shore and built new lives for themselves here. Interesting, I do have a lore video about that, so it's funny you should mention that, Lance. Has Camilla spoken to you about visiting Castle Village yet? 
No. Strange. Magnus hasn't been quiet about your latent magical abilities. Why do I feel like Magnus is like my proud grandfather that just like goes to all these magic meetings and he's like, yeah, well, Charlie in Pelican Town, you know, the one I bet. Yeah, Charlie, that one. Yeah, she's been talking to Junimo's uh, apples. The Junimo's her new best friend. I just I'm so proud of her. Here, let's go back down. Can you help me go to Castle Village? Because that is all I want. I desperately want to go to Castle Village. Well, that blink relic was the only test I needed. You handled it as if you'd been working with magical objects for years. I'll take it back now, if you don't mind. Lance! Why? I want it! Oh, frick. I'll be seeing more of you, Charlie. Farewell for now. Okay, well, it really seems like we're gonna be going to Castle Village soon, and I am so unbelievably excited for that. The other thing I need to do, though, before finishing this episode is I want to get the wine from Gus, and it looks as if all the villagers arrive between, like, 11 a.m. and they leave at 6. So I think I'll hang out on Ginger Island until maybe, like, 2 in the afternoon just to see if Gus shows up because I do want the wine, and if he doesn't, I will probably just go back Maybe go to the Highlands or something, do some exploring, but I really want to go to Castle Village, and I don't know how to unlock it. It seems like there might be some, like, hidden reason why Camilla won't let me go yet, like I need to prove myself, so maybe I need to do more exploring of the Crimson Badlands and see if there's, like, items or some areas that I missed. Um, okay, it doesn't appear that Gus is gonna be showing up, so I think I'm gonna leave now, which kind of sucks, but that's okay. Just means we have something to look forward to for next time. Okay, I'm gonna put the ancient fruit into Jojamart right now. I think that I have enough. Yeah, I have seven. Okay, perfect. All we really need now is the wine, so it's just a matter of waiting for that. Okay, well, I think this is gonna be the last day for this episode, and I really wanna head back to the Crimson Badlands and see if there's anything that we missed with the time we have left. I wouldn't be surprised if Camilla is just pulling some trickery being a bit of a hooligan, but we'll, we'll see. I have zero food. This is a horrible idea, but all right, I'm here anyway. <laughs> I thought that the diamond wand was bad when I first got it, but it's actually so good. It yeets enemies so far away. I don't even have to worry about them anymore. It is a good, good weapon. Thank you for that, Lance. Now, in terms of places to explore, we've already kind of gone along the left side. I haven't explored up here and to the right yet though, so I think I'm gonna do that. <gasps> There's people up there! Hi! Can you let me in? I didn't see anything along the right side of the desert, but maybe I missed something on the, the left. I am, my, might die. I, I really, honestly, truly might. And what are those things up there? And there's a thing here? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! There's a thing here! There's a thing! There's, 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 there's... I need to breathe. <laughs> I can't. Hold on, there's a... What is that?! I think I found the test that Camilla set out for me. Huh? And yeet you, and yeet you. Get out of me. What is this? What is this? Oh my god. Oh my god. Can I- I can't, I can't even- They're all moving! Camilla, I don't want to hear it, okay? I don't want to hear it from you. Where even is this? Space? Are you in space? What even is this? Be more careful out there. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Maybe if you hadn't put like a million freaking mummies in front of- whatever that was, then I'd be fine. Well, I think that's gonna be it for today, but we got so much stuff done. We went to like a million new places. We went to Scarlet's house. We are in the Crimson Badlands now, maybe Castle Village soon. We got a divorce, which kind of sucked, but you know, for the plot, we just, it had to happen. There is obviously so much more that this mod has to offer from like potions to, we haven't even been to the first slash guild hall. And I think a lot of that is gonna be through Lance and Camilla and getting to know them. So I'm really excited for it. And I hope you are too. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. And if you did, feel free to leave a like or subscribe to the channel. I'd love to have you here. All right, I will see you guys next time. Bye.